next one. Hello, hello. I am certainly not here to tell you how to play a saxophone like I said in my unboxing video. <laughs> By the way, I'm Kekira. If you're new, welcome to my life. I wish I could see you guys right now. That sounds creepy, right? Anyway, this week we're going to be focused on... week we're going to be focused on now nah, let's just get straight into the thumbnail <laughs> ladies and gentlemen let's talk about what happened after my unboxing video the saxophone right How you set it up?
oopsie look what i forgot i forgot to put the neck strap back in so i'm gonna put it back in now because i don't want to lose it. i purchased my alto saxophone on amazon i went through a heap of dilemma to actually get it like physically have it in my hand and it finally gets to me and with a burst of excitement there i am totally on plan making an unboxing video for you guys totally on plan okay who asked me that move up shikira you know i like to give my audience a little bit of backstory a little content to know where i'm coming from i went on youtube and i went through a series of videos trying to get somebody who's very good lessons for beginners so i'm going to show you guys who i came up with first i went to this guy yes, consulting. let's keep commercial so i started off with this guy he was good but not what i was looking for um then i migrated to somebody else there's this guy that i found after um guys that was literally me you know just scrolling up and down and looking for people there's this older guy Oh, there he is at the bottom here. I started following him. Actually, I learned a good bit of stuff from him. But then, what happened? Oh, after he got a long way, then he started skipping lessons. So as you can see, this is lesson two. So he had lesson two, lesson three, lesson four. And I was following him for like a while. And then he just stopped lesson five yeah but i learned quite a lot of the notes from this guy there are other persons i tried as well but this guy was my main guy so guys like i was saying i compiled a bunch of videos and i would binge watch them try to go through them play the saxophone and so forth that is where i learned most of my notes and those i can play very well those i can play very well I'm going to attempt some of these notes for you guys later on in this video, so stay tuned and let's continue. As you know, I did the basics. I got my music book, wrote down my notes and stuff. I was really just following the class, writing everything I could. I'm also going to be showing you guys my music book a little later. I actually drew a picture. No, did I? Oh my, I'm mixing it up. <laughs> Sorry, guys. When you play in more than one instrument, that's what happens. Hey guys, this is the book I got from ABNB Music, alto saxophone. It's just a music dictation book. And as the first things I recorded, uh, various notes to play. But these are all stuff that I learned to play. When I jog, my memory is going to come back to me, but of course not without practice. I know you hear saying, uh, only in the rhymes were here. We have to start as babies. We all have to crawl before we can walk. These are my nursery rhymes. I took a few films for y'all at my not so frequent rehearsal sessions but i'm sorry most of that got damaged and destroyed so i actually have to take some new ones to put in that video and i haven't played in a while so i'm not sure how rusty i'm going to sound but i am going to do it i'm going to try my best before i show you guys the well what i can do before i attempt anything and you guys laugh at me <laughs> i'm going to tell you what it is what are some of the barriers that prevented me from going all out with the saxophone let's start number one this thing is not easy to play period it's not easy to play but it's not impossible either second thing the alto saxophone that i got the strap that it came with 
it doesn't support my neck actually it hurts my neck really bad so that is one of the things i have on my shopping list to get number three the saxophone is really loud and can be very annoying especially if you just learning to play like myself and family friends even those who want to hear you play they can have a problem with it so i suggest getting a silencer that's something i also want to look into getting before i continue playing the saxophone number four maintenance guys if you leave the saxophone in the case without opening it for a while and stuff chances are when you see the saxophone it will not look as pretty as you left it there you would need to get something to clean it and that is what i'm going to get as well that is part of my shopping list i kind of alluded to that earlier the lessons on youtube are very inconsistent so it's best to get something consistent that you can follow that wouldn't be changing all the time and for you to be unstable and by extension get a bit frustrated kind of like how i did but i think it wasn't only the youtube the other underlying factors such as the, my neck strap um bothering my neck the noise annoying even my supporters and all of that was as a result of me putting it to rest and also causing it to get to the point where it is where i need a cleaner to get it looking in good shape right now i'm about to play the notes that i've learned and i'm just gonna put somewhere on the screen what note it is that i've played so this is b this is a this is g this is d this is e this was f so i'm gonna play a nursery rhyme let's see how that goes okay of course i need to get a music stand i'm gonna attempt to play hot cross buns <laughs> rolling along goes guys satisfied with my progress and i have been really going against all odds and little progress is still progress right so please if you really want to do something don't be a quitter continue no matter how slow no matter how tough it may seem i urge you keep going bye bye see you in my next video guys where we gonna talk about the guitar which seems to be overpowering the saxophone okay guys that's what happens when you don't practice you end up forgetting all the notes all the chords so practice is important wait a minute did i just insinuated that I can't handle the two instruments together, did I? <laughs> Let's find out. <laughs>